Shake the rattle. No. <laughs> okay, sorry guys, I'm gonna have to pause the recording. I will be right back. You won't notice a single thing change. Resuming. And okay. You probably got a small herd of me saying resume, but we're still here. We'll return and we're back. The kitten, she's fine. She's hopefully a lot better. Uh, you have the fighting spirit of your Aunt Martha. Yep, I already said that. You reach the destination, grab the rattle and drool on it. Yep. Shall I shake the rattle, keep drooling on it, or emit a pleasurable yell? I think I'm going to emit a pleasurable yell, because I was determined to get it. I finally got it. I had a lot of fun getting it. And I had a lot of fun with it. So I'm going to just, I'm going to go squeal happily. Oh, fantastic! This stimulates vocal cords and language centers in your brain. Good language skills are essential to development. Intellectual sphere increases. If no one is looking, give a little yell for yourself for choosing this option. Yay! I did it! I did it! It's like an option. Did you do it? Yep. <laughs> good. I just gave you some extra social points for being such a good sport. Mm! Get in there! <laughs> Did your DOS person have that? Yes. Oh, fantastic. Alright. Okay. Um, shall we continue on? Shall we try do each of them all on the way down? Like, and try and figure out as much as we can? Or shall we just skip Indeed. it? Indeed. Okay, let's go on. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> I'm looking for you for advice. Be my grim advisor, Grimmeth. No, you have to figure out things on your own. I am not your surrogate parent. <laughs> what was that earlier that you said that you were to me? <laughs> From my stupid inane comments. I don't know. Do you know? Uh, I might have forgotten. <laughs> what? No way. <laughs> Shush. A woman walks into a room holding a blanket and a bottle with warm Not white liquid. Not a woman, oh my god. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> okay, uh... Warm white liquid, it's a trap. <laughs> no. You are lactose intolerant, it's a trap. Oh, yeah, yeah, good point. Angry and cry. <laughs> like, angry and coo. No, 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 angry and cry. Next. The woman is your mother. She interprets as the, the crying as a sign that you need attention. She picks you up and holds you next to her where it is nice and warm. She feeds you. Some would say you have begun to show a pattern of manipulating people who are close to you. But at your age, a child cannot be spoiled. Unfortunately, your mother doesn't know this and begins to feel as if there is maybe something wrong with either herself or you. No, I'm lactose intolerant, but this is metagaming. We're a baby, but we're metagaming because we're smart. Uh, I'm gonna keep crying because that's the what baby is metagaming. <laughs> <laughs> keep laughing it up, Chuckles. I know I told a good joke there. Uh, uh, good joke. Shush. Just uh, keep crying. You are a difficult child who rejects your mother and the bottle. You send out loud wails, which makes your mother feel useless and inferior. Conflict with your parents seems certain if you persist with this kind of behaviour. I failed. <laughs> oh well. Good job, douchebag. Way to okay. make your mom feel useful. Uh, uh, derp. Yeah, we did. We did well in the other two. Kind of statistically, we fail in the third. Oh well. You are lying on a soft furry blanket on the floor of a big room. You are on your back staring at shadows that sometimes keep across the ceiling. Every so often mum or dad passes by and makes a funny face. Your hands grope in all directions and your feet pat the floor gently, almost out of your control. I'll be happy because I'm still getting attention from my parents because they're, you know, they're making funny faces. They're giving me some attention. And unfortunately, I feel like I'm losing control. So you're going to cry. You'll be happy and you'll cry for tears of joy because you're getting attention. Absolutely. That's not going to work. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um... Out of control, but maybe try to get into control. But if I'm happy, I'm not going to roll to side to side. I'm going to make O faces. 
I'm going to go, oh, uh, if I'm sad, I'm going to cry. If I'm mad, I'm going to roll to say to say. But I want to be happy because I'm getting attention from my parents, but not as much as I should. So, ah, this is tough. <laughs> uh, I believe I'm an optimistic person. I'm going to be I'm generally happy, so I'm just going to say, obviously parents are doing their usual thing, but they're still giving me attention and love. So, I'm going to make happy O shapes with my mouth. I'm going to make my O face. <laughs> you pucker your cheeks in and out and take short, quick breaths. The skin of your face feels alternately tight and loose. A person walks by and twirls their finger at you. I'll turn toward the person because someone's giving me attention. You're too young to keep the person in view for a long time. Whoever it is, he moves past in a blur. Okay. Ah, right, I sort of turned away. Derp. Ah, <sighs> social. You are lying down in your crib and are greeted by a nosy neighbour who is a child just your age. The neighbour says, my, look at that funny little nose. She turns to your mother and adds, don't worry dear, I hear that noses are the last thing to look truly human. She picks you up. I just got insulted. You did. My nose looks funny. I don't like this woman. Yeah, I'm going to be angry and vengeful towards this woman, because that's, no, that's mean. That's mean. You don't insult me. I'm a baby, for God's sake. You're supposed to say I look cute. Uh, collect a mouthful of drool, cry, or fall asleep. What would be the most angry approach to put towards her? Uh, crying. Mm. Yeah, I could see that. Collect a mouthful of drool to just go bleh all over, or just fall asleep. It's like, I don't care. Now I see, falling asleep would be the passive approach, collecting a mouthful of drill would be passive, and crying would be the aggressive one. So I'm going to be angry and vengeful, and I'm going to cry. Really? C collecting a mouthful of drill is passive? No, actually, no, that would be vengeful, because I would ruin her top by going blah all over it. So that would be actually quite interesting, you know? I don't, I don't think anyone would really appreciate a baby drooling all over them, because I know Mrs. Griff would be like, ugh! So, next. A nice puddle of saliva is formed on the inside of your mouth. Open your mouth and drool on the neighbour. Yes. 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 Splash. A gooey stream showers your neighbour's face and hands. While you give her a glassy-eyed smile, she places you back in the crib and excuses herself. I, I, that's a victory. I class that as a victory. Um, I assume I can click on one of these. I can see my age. Yeah, you can click on your stats. <laughs> there are seven stages in life in Alter Ego. You're from the nice birth. You may select icons in any order. They are sorted approximately in chronological order. Feel free to explore. Just close this window when you want to quit. Uh, Just like continue then? Continue. Oh, oh, no, wait. I'm an infancy. It said at the top, you are an infancy. So let's have a look at my stats. Familial, 65. I'm very intelligent. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Physical, 30. Social, I am meh. I'm not bad with my family. Bit poor socialized, bit poor, vocational. Average, average, I guess. I think it's out of 100, yeah? Yeah. Well, I'm very smart, apparently. Uh, not very calm. Not very gentle. Incredibly happy. Incredibly expressive. Eh, below average for thoughtfulness and trustworthiness. <laughs> not very gentle? <laughs> out of 1 to 100, it's 4. Well, that's not very. <laughs> I'll get better. It's only a flash wound. <laughs> Yeah, I've only lopped off my arm from bumping into everything, so I'm incredibly clumsy, apparently. And it's I have money. It's gentleness and clumsiness, as gentleness in how much of a dick you are to other people. Okay, so I'm a serious dick to people. Um... <laughs> That's pretty much what it's supposed to be for babies, I think. You yeah. Dick. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's, oh, an intellectual challenge. Let's see what this intellectual challenge You are dying down in the crib while your mum and dad are speaking in the other room. You hear their voices deep and muffled from beyond the door. Why aren't they paying attention to you? Um, sad, and I'm going to make noises because I want to lure them through. You begin to cry. This alarms your parents and is a negative... Oh. Ooh. 
bugger. Oops. Daddy comes in holding a bottle of warm milk which satisfies you temporarily. I derped. How's my intellect doing? Oh, my intellect's still high. Uh, oh, wait, my familial went up. So I'm better with my family, I guess? Okay. Emotional. You have just awakened from a, lo a nice long nap. Your mom comes in and wants to hold you. Uh... I'd be cranky. But, Why? But my mum's just woke me up and wants to hug me. Well, I just awoke. I just she woke up. She didn't wake you up. You just awoke yourself from a nice long nap. Ah, you're you're making me want to. You're making me read these questions better. Ah, see, it's good to have you here. You're making me read. You have just wakened up from a nice long nap, so I'd be happy then. Derp. Okay, yeah, yeah. Grimace is sighing because I am a derp. Now, are you going to be happy and cry, do nothing, or smile I at your mom? Smile. Smile at my mom. Smile at my mom. This is a great way to make your mom feel good. Your consideration earns you many points in many spheres. You will find that as life progresses, pleasing mother becomes harder and harder. In a few years, it will take doing chores and going to the store. Before you know it, she'll want you to become a doctor or a lawyer. Enjoy your infancy while you can. Your mom picks you up so that your face touches her face. Select a note in action. Move your mouth. I'll be still. Move my mouth. You just gave your first kiss. This may not seem like a very big deal to you, but it is very important to your mother. The bad part is now that you will have to repeat this act until your entire family becomes aware of your new talent. You can avoid kissing overly affectionate relatives by dribbling on them just at the right moment. Well, we've already practiced dribbling. Okay, let's see. Wow, family went up. I'm still a huge dick. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but uh, I seem to not be as happy as I was, but oh well. Right, okay. Family, intellect, or fa family or intellect? So we got a family challenge, or we have an intellectual challenge. What are you going to do, Griffin? Dun 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 da 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 boom. It's time to go to Aunt Lucy's house. It's chilly outside, and you need to be dressed in a. Oh wait, and you need to be dressed in a coverall type suit. Uh... Um. Now, uh, playful. Cooperate. You know, it's chilly outside. Dress up in a coverall. I think it's a good idea. Don't really know who Aunt Lucy is. Maybe a nice person, might not be a nice person. But it's cold. Let's cooperate. What's a good baby? Your mother has a very little trouble getting you into your suit. Your grandmother holds you while your mum gets dressed. <laughs> Spit up on her. Give her a great big smile. You're behaving yourself very nicely today. This is one of those express experiences that your grandma will always remember. You just have to become one of her favorite grandchildren. You have just became one of her grand favorite grandchildren. Fantastic, and will be rewarded handsomely later in life. This can help if you get yourself into a jam, which you undoubtedly will. Okay. Nice one, I succeeded. Uh, intellect. You're quietly playing with your mother's pocketbook. What's a pocketbook? Like a diary? Or is it like a purse or something? It's like a purse. Right, okay. Inquisitive. Look but don't touch. Yeah, let's look but not touch. Your self control is quite remarkable. Look at all those tiny little bottles and tubes. Bottles and tubes? What? In a purse? Yeah. In a pocketbook. You're a baby. How the fuck are you supposed to interpret things? Griffin's now scrunching his face up trying to interpret it as if he were a baby. <laughs> yes. Good job. 